Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm showing you um, my Ulta slash, I guess, TJ Maxx haul. They just opened up an Ulta about 10 minutes away from where I live. So I went there yesterday to kind of just scope it out. And then I went today because today was the actual grand opening. So I got a few products um, from yesterday and today. And then I went over to um, TJ Maxx just because that's one of my favorite places to go because they have everything. You can, like I found, um, you guys will see later, but I found a couple high-end products there. One that I picked up for sure, but there were a lot of high-end products there that I've never seen before, so of course I swooped them up as soon as I seen them. But yeah, so let's just get on into the video. Um, I'm going to start off with the Ulta products. Actually, no. I'll start off with the TJ Maxx products just because there's fewer of them, and we'll save the best for last. So, whenever I go into TJ Maxx, I always go to their beauty section first. I always go to the sale aisle because it's one of my favorite aisles. I can find so many things there, super cheap, that maybe I won't use right away, but I can put them in my kit and keep them and have them put back. One of the first things I had seen were these Eyelore Natural Lights. Um, I don't know if you guys can see that. They're just really, really, really pretty... Um, natural wings what are these called false eyelashes um yeah and they're falling off in there these ones are pretty much already fallen off of the glue but it comes with the glue and they were only a dollar so i thought hey i could use them for when i do home when i do prom or homecoming makeup so why not pick them up for a dollar a piece i'm not going to pass up some fake eyelashes um the next two products i got were both round brushes uh, this one, I believe, was, this is the Fahrenheit Hair Care System. It says Reaction Heat Activated Ion Technology, and this is a two and a half barrel. This one, I believe, was a dollar, and then the other one I got was the Elegant Porcupine Round Brush, and this looks maybe like a two inch, and this was two dollars. I'm not sure. One of them was $1, one of them was $2, so of course I'm not going to pass them up. I don't think you can ever have enough round brushes. I did use this one today, and it actually dried my hair quicker when I was, um, like, blowing out my hair, you know. It dried my hair so much quicker than my other brushes I used. I don't know. It says heat-activated ion ionic technology, so maybe that's why. Maybe it's something in the brush. Maybe I'm crazy. I don't know. I really don't. When I see the brushes that are like, oh, it'll dry your hair so much faster, blow dryer, you have cut down the amount on blow, like drying time. I don't ever believe them. Um, the next product I picked up from TJ Maxx, it was just this e.l.f. cream eyeliner. I've heard a lot of people rave about these, but I mean, I like e.l.f. products. I really do. I have almost every single shade in their mineral eyeshadows that you can have, but um i seen this and I really like the color. I thought I could use this as either an eyeliner or an eyeshadow base. I don't know. It's just in golden. And it came with this little, like, angled brush. But, yeah, this is the color. It's golden and pretty. I'll swatch it for you. Soon. But it would work for, like, a cream base or something of that nature. Um, the last product that I got at TJ Maxx was a high-end product which I when I seen this I swooped up I didn't even care if it worked if it didn't work I wanted it it was the Too Faced anyways this is the Too Faced um, liquid eyeliner what is this stemmed long stemmed lashes is what it's called liner on one side which is what I used today I'm not sure if you guys can tell but it is crazy pigmented like one swipe that's how it comes out and then on the other line, on the other side is a serum, just a clear serum that you put on, like if you were lining your lashes, you put it on your lashes um, at night. So it was $7.99. They had all kinds of them there. So they weren't on sale. I'm telling you right now, as soon as you have time, go to your TJ Maxx and check out the beauty section. If you got crazy far away to go to an Ulta, and I hated it, but now there's only there's one like 20 minutes away from where I live, if that. So definitely was so excited when I seen them put it in I've like kept driving by to see when it opened yesterday I seen like the now open sign and it was like ah! like angels came down and it was awesome um, but yesterday I'll try and do these in the days that I went 
Uh, I do have one product that I don't have to show you. It was the Macadamia hair hair mask, and I didn't buy the full size product. I brought I bought the um, trial size just because I didn't want to spend thirty five dollars and me not like a product because a lot of the hair masks I use don't ever work. I don't ever notice a difference, and I don't I don't like paying the money for them if I'm not going to notice a difference. If I'm not going to like or if they don't do what they say they're going to do. So I bought the trial size. I used it yesterday. I only bought one. I wish I would have picked up a couple more. I thought about it today and then I was so busy looking at everything else that I completely forgot to get it. But um, I picked it up. I used it last night in the shower. Dry, and later I was just like running my fingers through my hair. It felt so soft, so smooth. I told Kyle, I was like, feel my hair. You know, I used this mask on it. He even thought it, like he even felt a difference. So I'm definitely going to go back and get the full size product, but I just, I didn't do it today. I was so excited. When I went, to I never knew I liked the spray and play until I got it in my Ipsy bag a few months ago and I realized like I love it. It's one of the best hairsprays. I went through it like crazy. I mean it lasted me a really good, a really, a long period of time for as small as the bottle is, but they had these trial sizes so I thought, you know, they were, I'm pretty sure they were three dollars a piece so it was buy two get one free so for six dollars I got all three of these I got a spray and play which is just a hairspray and then I got two root pump. root pump this is just a volumizing spray mousse um, and then I got the tangle teaser which and I actually like it really does work it doesn't pull your hair it like is so nice so ugh, I love this thing um, it, yeah, it does look a little weird. It's like just fits in your palm just nicely so you can just brush your hair through it. It has the long and, or the tall and the smaller, like, prongs, I guess you'd say, bristles on it. So that is what prevents your hair from getting tangled and twisted and being pulled on. So I definitely like this. It was $10. Yes. So it was awesome. And then today when I went, they had their NYX products. It was buy one, get one, 50% off. Uh, lip glosses. One is in Strawberry Parfait and the one I'm wearing right now is in Peaches and Cream. I don't have anything else on my lips other than the Peaches and Cream. So they are like really pigmented for a lip gloss, for a butter gloss. And they feel super like moisturizing. Like they don't feel too sticky. I mean they are a little sticky but not bad. Not anything I couldn't deal with. I don't... Stuff like that doesn't bother me. But not not too bad. So these were, I believe, $4.99, buy one, get one, half off. What I got was the Stay Matte But Not Flat NYX um, HD Powder. Yeah, powder foundation. And it says on the side, apply dry as is for full coverage. Apply with a wet sponge for heavy duty coverage. Um, what I did was I got the Stay Matte But Not Flat foundation and powder. Just to try them out, I got my color is in medium beige, and you can't really even tell. It's so oily. Made it. My skin is so oily that it doesn't even make a difference no matter how much matte products I put on it. So, and at the end of the day, I do put oil on my face before everybody's freaking out saying, you are putting, like, it's not going to matter, you need to put oil into your face so it will stop the oil production. I know that. <laughs> But I do do that. I put oil on at night or in the morning. But I still don't. Like, I notice a difference. My face isn't as oily. But when I'm using matte products that are supposed to keep it from getting oily, keep it from getting shiny, they don't. Or not that I notice. So I got the Stay Matte But Not Flat. This is the NYX Powder Foundation. Just looks like that. And then the Liquid Foundation as well. They are both in medium beige. I use them both today. The coverage for them is great for, I mean, I think this was $8.99 for everyday coverage. I'll do more of an update or review on them if you guys would like to see it. Thumbs up this video, leave me a comment and let me know for sure. And I will kind of give you, as I wear it longer, because today is the first day I've noticed, or I've worn it. So maybe as it like sets into my face, it'll do what it's supposed to. The last thing and the most exciting thing I think I got from Ulta. This is the, I don't want to say it wrong, Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Genius the, Kit. Um, brow powder, the brush, and the clear waterproofing gel. 
so a really long time. I do my eyebrow my I do my eyebrows every single day. So if I think this is gonna last me a long time and I do my eyebrows every day, all the time, crazy amounts of time, every single day, all the time, yeah. I think like it's worth the twenty-four dollars. If you guys have not tried Anastasia, Anastasia. I don't know. But if you've not tried this, please, please, please go out. It is worth the money. Go buy it now. Buy it now. Buy me now. It's worth the money. It is awesome. And you will love it. Yeah. So that is it for my Ulta tar. Where did I go? That is it for my Ulta and TJ Maxx haul. Please leave them down below. I will get back to you as soon as I can. Remember, I do work at night, so if I don't get back to you until early morning or late at night, please don't hate me. I try to get back to you guys as soon as possible. And yeah, if you guys haven't sub subscribed, make sure you subscribe, hit that button, leave all your concerns down below or questions, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching.